guys, it's Fanboy TV here with Pocky, I think. Am I still Pocky? Yeah, I'm still Pocky, apparently. I'm getting tired, it's getting late, but we're still here for you. And right now, I'm with Tim for Mega Bloks and a mech warrior robot that's probably going to shoot me later, I it's think. Beast of a Mantis, that's right. They've been it calling is. him Freckles all day. I would call, I'd call, I'd call him Tiny, just for fun. Irony, kids, irony. Look it up. So, Mega Bloks has just exploded on the scene. I we mean, have, yeah. You, you guys have been, you guys started off very small, uh, in, like buckets of blocks, and then recently you guys got Halo, you've gotten the World of Warcraft license. Uh, Call of Duty. Call of Duty. Just last year, and this year we're announcing Assassin's Creed as well. Wow, parkour Lego, parkour Mega Bloks. That is just that is way more fun. That's right. And you guys have been doing really well. You've got this gigantic robot. Your fans have been taking these blocks and just running with them. Yeah, we try uh, to make an impression everywhere we go. I mean, you've uh, we've seen some people here. They're building they're building their own stuff, and they're just they're building some very impressive models. Yeah. Um. I, I best way I think I can ask really is. What do you guys think that led to a lot of these, you know, these big events happening right now? Well, we want to get our name out there. I think there's no question about it that, that we're doing something really cool, really exciting in the industry. Yeah. We're making these amazing micro action figures uh, yes. in all of our lines. Uh, they're amazingly posable, interchangeable armor in just this tiny little scale right here. We have 21 different individual pieces. Wow. Uh, so it's an amazing. Uh, thing that our design teams that are accomplishing so we want to get the word out about that we want to we want to show that we're doing some really amazing stuff the, the, that is something I have noticed about mega blocks is that when you guys make figurines they're just not like squares these are fully movable they're there part moves it everything about them is interchangeable you can, you can mix and match uh, the Call of Duty one. The, I, I'm assuming the Assassin's Creed is going to be insanely just detailed. as posable, just as detailed, just as uh, just as many pieces that are interchangeable amongst them. That that's going to be quite insane. completely. What we try to really do is try to make our stuff as authentic to the franchise or the series that it is based on, and uh, try to make it just as, as cool looking as possible and as fun to play with and pose and display as possible. Since you got you do say you work very you do you work very closely with them. With like the you designers, get the, the designers like, hey, here's what Master Chief looks like, or here's what the soldiers look like, and they look at it and they go, eh, you, you're almost there. You need to do this and that. Yeah, I'm I'm hardly the guy who tells them what Master Chief looks like. They're the ones who know. They know the series inside and out. Um, I do all the social media, so my sort of role in the whole position in the uh, the whole uh, process really is getting feedback from the fans, letting the designers know what the fans are looking for, yeah. and then also sometimes it goes the other way around. The designers will ask me to ask the fans, what do you want to see in terms of a, a flying vehicle next year? Uh, what do you want to see in terms of a massive 3,000 piece set? Uh, and we ask the fans, poll them, get a thousand answers or so, and bring it back to the designers and see what happens. And your, your fans have been very vocal, and I, I've noticed a lot of their opinions, they're, they're, they're they're as worried not just for the Mega Bloks, but for the franchise they're representing. Absolutely. And that's, that's very cool of them. Um, when, if they wanted more information about Mega Bloks, we're uh, just on the Mega Bloks website, where else could they go? Well, of course, there's the Mega Bloks website. I'm biased, of course, when I say hit me up on social media. Yeah. I run all of the social media for Mega Bloks, so uh, they can find me personally running the Facebook page, Mega Bloks Collectors, uh, and also the Twitter feed, the Instagram feed, et cetera, et cetera. So uh, I'm, I'm sort of out there. I'm listening to the fans. We're listening to the fans, and uh, we want to make stuff even cooler than it already is. And you guys definitely are doing that. So, when is the Assassin's Creed release date? October of this year, 2014. So right when Unity should come out. That's exactly and right. So you, so if you guys collect your Mega Bloks, get your Assassin's Creed. I'm hoping to get Acre. Now I can build Acre in in Mega Block form. That would be great. Uh, Tim, it has been great talking to you, and good luck, and and I hope you guys have fun here. Thanks, Chris. 